Hi, Harry. How are you doing? Hi, Stacy. How are you doing? No, I'm Tracy. My uh, twin is Stacy. Oh, uh, sorry. That's okay. It's really good to meet you in person. Um, thank you for choosing Tracy and Stacy's Career Services. Uh, uh, would you like to take off your helmet? Oh, sorry. Sometimes I forget I'm wearing it. Hang on. So, before we go over your aptitude tests, uh, I'd like to get to know you a little bit better. Um, uh, are you okay? Oh, uh, sorry. Uh, the suit is riding up a little bit. Do you mind if I change it? Oh, sh sure. Uh, yeah, go ahead. Oh, oh. Uh, oh, uh. Wait a minute. Oh, wait. Uh, hang on. Hang on. Uh, that's closer. Hang on. Hang on just a second. Just a second. There. I think I got it now. Okay, so, like I was saying earlier, uh, before you go over your aptitude tests, uh, I'd like to get to know you a little bit better. Um, can you tell me a little bit about yourself? Oh, sure. Well, let's see. Uh, my name is Harry Serenus. Uh, I'm 40 years old. Uh, I have a wife named Harrietta, and she's 29 years old and um, has been for quite a long time now. Like years, if you know what I mean. <laughs> um, uh, yeah. Uh, uh huh. My wife is really something. Uh, just the other night, she dressed up in this skin tight pink latex bodysuit. Um, I said, Honey, I didn't know you were into that kind of kinky stuff. She says, I'm not. I have to wear something waterproof to bed because you drool so much when you sleep. Why, that sounds terribly inappropriate. I know. You try sleeping with someone wearing rubber pajamas. Uh-huh. Anyway, um, I have a son named Harry Jr. And I have a daughter named Harrietta Jr. Uh, Harrietta Jr.? Oh, yeah. And I have a dog named Itchy. Uh, he likes to scratch a lot, so I named him Itchy. Uh, boy, that little Itchy Serenus sure likes to be petted and scratched all the time. Ha <laughs> ha! Okay, well, you know, I was a little curious about your name. Harry Serenus? Uh... That's a little unusual. Um, have you ever thought of changing it? Oh, uh, I did change it. My name used to be Harry Fataz. P-H-A-T-A-Z-Z. -Z. Fataz. Harry Fataz. But everybody mispronounced it all the time, making it sound like something bad. So I changed it. So you changed it to Harry Soranus. And a proud name it is. The history and tradition of the Serenus name goes all the way back to, uh, well, I, when I changed it from Fadaz, uh, which was before I was married. Wow, and she married you anyway? Um, oh, never mind. Um, hey, we should talk about your work history since, uh, we're here for your career, um. Oh, sure. Um, what would you like to know? Uh, your, uh, work history? Well, um, yes, of course, um, I'm kind of a noob, so I don't have a lot. Well, what have you tried? Well, I tried mining, and I blew myself up. And I tried uh, to find some guy in a cave, and I blew myself up. Um, and, uh, and I tried delivering a package. Uh, and? I 
blew myself up. Okay, so uh, let's stay away from the jobs with explosives then. Oh, and I did take a mission to clear a bunker once. And uh, you blew yourself up? No, shot dead by an NPC. Okay, let's try a different angle. Uh, if you could have any job that you wanted, what would it be? I want to be rich. Uh, someone important. Well, like an actor. Uh, this is Star Citizen, not The Matrix. Oh, well, I could be a comedian. Uh, maybe give stand-up a try? You don't really have the face for comedy, Harry. You look more like, um... The alienated head of a dysfunctional family on a soap opera. Oh, great. I already got that job. Did I tell you about my wife and kids? It doesn't matter. Um, there aren't any acting or comedy jobs in Stanton that I know of. Uh, how about a rock and roll star? Not sure I've seen any musician jobs open either. I did put together a rock and roll band once. I put out ads and I got a drummer and a guitar player, and a singer, and a bass player, and everything was going great uh, until they kicked me out of the band. Just because I couldn't sing or play an instrument. I see. They went platinum without me. Totally ungrateful. Uh, what was the band's name? I refused to speak their name. Uh, but I wanted to call us Harry Serenus and the Scratchers. Well... I can see why they kicked you out. That's okay. I moved on. I developed a new strategy for living in the fullest. Oh, what would that be? Well, pep talks. Pep talks to myself are very important. Uh, every morning I get up and look in the mirror and I say, Harry, tomorrow you're going to get your shit together. And then I go back to bed. And... Uh, how's that been working? Well, I'm getting a lot of sleep. Yes, okay. Well, I think I've learned enough about you for now. Um, we should discuss the results of your aptitude tests. Uh, oh, definitely. I've been looking forward to that. Um, uh, how did I do? Well, you failed. I failed? Uh... Which aptitudes did I fail at? You, yeah, pretty much all of them. That can't be true. All of them? Well, let me check. Uh, yep, pretty much all of them. In fact, your overall score was a minus two, which is weird because I didn't think you could get less than a zero. Um, but don't get discouraged. Uh, because I have a position open, and I think you'll be an excellent fit for it. Oh, good. Um, and what position is that? Well, have you ever been to the refinery on Cruel 1? Uh, yeah. Yeah, so, you know that guy that's, uh, on the catwalk and he's kneeling down, and he looks like he's, uh... Pretending to look at something? Um, you know, that guy, he's like, he's right, right in the middle of the catwalk. And uh, you, you kind of like trip over him uh, if you don't watch out. But he's kneeling down and he's looking at something, uh, but I can't figure out what it is. Yeah, it seems like he's always there. Well, you see, that guy actually quit. And there's an intern that's been covering for him, but that position is open, and I think it's a perfect fit for you. But, uh... Oh! Oh! Look at the time! Uh, I've got another appointment I've got to make. Uh, it was so good to meet you, uh, Harry. Um, uh, yeah, don't, don't call me. I'll call you, okay? All right. All right. I'll see you later. Bye!